how do you go about programming your trackers? You know, you've got your receiver and your actual trackers. The tools you'll need to configure your trackers and program them is this tool right here, a link in the description. First thing you want to do is when you get your trackers and you're programming for the first time and only for the first time, you want to go to the fourth pin from the edge on this side and then underneath it it will say rst and then you want to plug in your tracker or receiver double tap on the shield of the usb and then in about four seconds a usb drive should pop up next thing you want to do is refresh your serial port select the serial port for this device and you want to press connect once connected you want to select the firmware in this case if this is going to be a tracker and you're using the same tutorial as my other one for actual soldering it then you want to use this one nrf tracker spi stacked small and then you want to press upgrade firmware is going to download the firmware automatically for you and then it will automatically put this into usb drive and then it copies the firmware to the actual drive once done you'll hear that the drive has been dismounted and then we'll say done firmware successfully flashed next thing you want to refresh the port connect to it again and look everything works right if you're configuring the tracker you select the tracker tab and if you're configuring the receiver select receiver tab now first thing is you actually need to pair the tracker with the dongle so what you want to do here is plug in the receiver like so refresh the ports connect to it and then now you want to go over to receiver tab and pairing mode next you want to turn on your tracker and then done it literally says added packet zero with id and then done 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 next thing you want to plug in the next tracker done and that's pretty much it i connected all my trackers up and then i want to exit pairing mode and that's pretty much it you want to unplug preferably restart your computer then you want to plug it back in open up the slime vr server and then it'll connect all the trackers to each other now how do you go about calibrating well if you click on the tracker and you're connected to it you have all these options calibrate calibrate six sides maglin and so on and so on what you want to do is calibrate your six sides and then calibrate sensor zero you literally do it by, by just clicking on calibrate six sides and you'll start doing it but for me it won't work because well there is no imu on here okay great you calibrated it everything works but it's been a month and you want to upgrade your firmware now what do you do well firstly we're going to update the dongle in this case we want to refresh connect to the dongle you want to select firmware for the dongle if you're using just a standard nri 52 like like this one then you just want to select slime nrf super mini receiver you press upgrade your firmware and then it does everything for you it takes up to 20 seconds and that's pretty much it you do the same with all the trackers but you got to note that it clears all your data so what you have to do is you want to go over to receiver pairing mode do everything you had to do before and then exit pairing mode and then same thing with calibration you want to plug in your tracker you want to calibrate six sides and then calibrate and then that's pretty much it hopefully this is enough if you have any questions leave them in the comments if you have any issues with the software please make a issue and address your issues and i mean that's it hopefully this will be of use to someone and i will see you in another video bye